Handoffs in women can be extremely embarrassing and unwanted. While men can get away with a bald head, it is certainly not possible for women. This can be very emotionally painful. So Dr. Torgerson, there are options for hair restoration, but in the first place, what causes hair loss for women? There's a lot of reasons why women lose their hair. Um, some of them include common things like pregnancy, stress, or medical reasons like certain hormonal imbalances, certain drugs, or even autoimmune disorders. If these can be ruled out first, some of the other important factors to consider are your genetics. Um, one genetic disorder that's really common is called androgenic alopecia. And this is basically inherited hair loss that comes from either your mom's side or your dad's side. And it doesn't just happen in men, it also happens in women. One of the big differences is the pattern of hair loss that women display compared to men. While men lose their hair um, in the center and sort of left with a horseshoe or a cul-de-sac, women start losing their hair towards the top of their head and it thins out from the center. This can be really, really embarrassing for women, especially when they're trying to cover it up. So, Dr. Torgerson, what are some of the options that are available for a woman looking for hair restoration? Well, hair transplants really, really come a long way, and one of the latest and greatest innovations is called follicular unit extraction, or neograft. And this is um, where we will take hairs that never go away, that are located towards the back of the head, extract them out one by one so it doesn't leave any scarring, and then carefully implanting them into the region of hair loss, again, one by one, so that the overall result is natural, quick, and virtually painless. How long should a woman expect to take off of work and off of her daily schedule if she undergoes FUE hair transplant or neograft? Well, this has been another dramatic improvement in that usual downtime for these procedures are up to just two to three days, where in the past it could have been upwards of two weeks. If you are a woman who is experiencing hair loss and is considering a hair transplant, we welcome you to book an appointment here at our cosmetic surgical facility where you'll be under the expert care of Dr. Corey Torgerson and be able to discuss all of the available options to you.